Chad Colby's look at agriculture technology comes your way next, brought to you by the IBM Watson Decision Platform. Combining AI with Internet of Things data to help agribusiness increase yields, improve quality, and drive sustainability. Well, our tech correspondent, Chad Colby, is back from Las Vegas. He was out there a week or so ago for the Consumer Electronics Show, provided those updates here on This Week in Agribusiness. This week, he's back around home, taking a look at some of the new technology that could help farmers be a little more comfortable. I've got an interesting technology segment this week. Do you have sensitive eyes at all? I sure do. And over the years, I've kind of combated that with window tint on my vehicles. You can see that bright light right there. I don't have any window tint right here in this video segment. That bright light has always bothered me. And for the last, I would tell you, probably at least 30 years, my goodness, I've put window tint on my vehicles to help with that. Now, the technology has changed quite a bit. The fellow that I use has been in business over 30 years in Peoria. And on my last vehicle a couple years ago, he introduced me to some new technology that really does an amazing job at blocking out those UVs. The other thing he showed me this past week was some new technology he got to help that installation process. Not only does it go a lot faster, but it's a lot better. And he uses a computer and plotter, and the computer downloads the actual size of the glass that he's going to tint, and it will cut out the exact size of window tint material. And it makes the process so much faster because you're not sitting there with a razor blade and cutting out the window tint, quite honestly, like we used to do. Um, I think a lot of us have done window tinting. You can buy the tint at your local auto parts store. But this is a little more advanced than that. As you might suspect, window tint is purchased in various shades. You can get it as dark as limo tint where you can't see in it at all. That's never been my intent. My intent is just make the vehicle a little more comfortable. Now, the new ceramic coatings have done that in an amazing way. You could feel the heat difference from that heat lamp right away in your hand. I grabbed a thermal gun because I wanted to show that to you, and it's almost a 30-degree difference in temperature. Can you imagine the difference of that on your tractor windows or maybe in your semi? It's a huge difference. Now, once I got my vehicle done, Troy was kind enough to kind of walk through some of the maintenance, and it's all pretty basic. It comes with a lifetime warranty if you would ever scratch it or damage it. And honestly, I've never had a problem. Now, vehicles look amazing with the windows tinted like you see here. That looks really good, but that's, that's really never my motive behind doing this. It's I want it more comfortable. You can see right here in the bright sun, I don't have really dark window tint, but let me tell you, that new ceramic coating works amazing, and it works phenomenal at night as well. It's just a new technology to consider. For This Week in Agribusiness, I'm Chad Colby. Thank you, Chad, for that update. Always appreciate Chad's insight on what's happening in technology. Later on in the program, Greg Solier will be with us for a weather report in the week ahead.